I was in kindergarten, there was a forest preserve between our house and the school. And we would walk through the forest preserve to go to school, even though we weren't supposed to. I remember the forest, the, the clearing, the path. Then there was a playground finally and a, a very tall slide. house and it had a marsh in back and we would go in the marsh and take clear jars and trap tadpoles. In Summit we had a really small backyard with a chain link fence there was a garage in the back, a brick garage, and there was a little bed of flowers that didn't really grow very well. My father, he would keep the grass really long, longer than the other neighbor's grass. So I remember it kind of, you know, hanging over, you know, whereas everyone else's was short, sticking up. and I would lie out there in the summertime and try to get a suntan. In Summit, Argo, we lived in a basement apartment, so it was mostly below ground. There were small little windows above ground, and the apartment was filled with smoke because my mom smoked constantly, and it was impossible to get away from the, from the smoke. There was never a moment that you could ever get away from anybody. I, I remember sitting in my father's den with my, my brother and two sisters and passing a bowl of potato chips. We were allowed to only take one at a time. And my father telling us he was gonna get divorced from my mother and he started to cry. I was seven. I remember every time my, my dad would cut my hair, he would cut my bangs super short and I would go into the bathroom and look at myself in the mirror and cry. Now I have to cut you, have to cut your bangs really short. Look at yourself in the mirror and cry. What does your bathroom look like? I just remember a mirror. <laughs> 